Welcome to Apple. Welcome to Apple. Hi, I'm she Tim. Should be here any minute. How is the weather coming in? Hi, I'm Tim. Yeah, I'm gonna do the offices already carbon neutral, then, right? Yeah, all yours. We didn't keep you waiting. Mother Nature. Mother Nature, welcome to Apple. How, how is the weather getting in? The weather was however I wanted it to be. Let's cut to the chase. In 2020, you promised to bring Apple's entire carbon footprint to zero by 2030. Henry David Thoreau over here said we have a profound opportunity to build a more sustainable future for the planet we share. I think our 10 o'clock said the same thing. They all do. All right. This is my third corporate responsibility gig today, so who wants to disappoint me first? Well, we've got some updates we are excited to share with you. Materials? Status? Is there a materials person here? Yes. We are in the process of eliminating all plastic from our packaging by the end Let me guess. 50 years from now, when someone else is left holding the bag? By the end of next year, actually. When we're also currently using 100% recycled aluminum in the enclosures of all our MacBooks, Apple TVs, Apple Watch. What about iPod Shuffle? The, well, I don't, it's, I don't do that. it's a joke. Don't you people make Ted Lasso? Oh, that's a different group. Um, we're also phasing out leather in our iPhone cases. What about Brando over there? They phasing you out too? Oh. What's next? Electricity. Electricity, status. Uh, uh, we're operating on 100% clean electricity. What runs on 100% clean electricity? Every Apple office, store, and data center runs on clean electricity, thanks to you and your powerful wind and, and sun. Mm. And cool. Apple offices are already carbon neutral. Yeah. This building is carbon neutral? Oh, yeah, we, we do it with a mix of clean energy and eliminating greenhouse emissions. It's kind of like if you were to- You're uh, seriously explaining carbon neutrality to Mother Nature? Right, no, I'm sorry. You want to tell me how photosynthesis works too? Don't. Um, also, over 300 suppliers have committed to using 100% clean, renewable electricity. What's next? Transportation. I'm proud to report that we're shipping more products by ocean rather than air, which reduces transportation emissions by 95%. 95%? Not too bad. I'm also happy to report that we're investing in projects around the world that protect the Earth's soil, plants, and trees. <laughs> Everyone says they're planting trees. We've planted forests. Oh, hello. Where? Paraguay, Brazil. What, are you trying to save the tropical savanna? Yes. And we've also restored mangroves in Colombia. What else? Grasslands in Kenya. Why? Our aim is to permanently remove carbon from the atmosphere. What about your water usage? We've reduced it. By how much? 63 billion gallons. 63 million? Billion. As you can see, we've innovated and retooled almost every part of our process to reduce our impact on the planet. But there's still a lot more work to do. And there's something else we wanted to share with you. You're not trying to bribe Mother Nature with Apple swag. It's Apple's very first carbon neutral product. Hmm. I want to see you do more of this. You will. When? By 2030, all Apple devices will have a net zero climate impact. All of them? All of them. They better. They will. Okay, good. See you next year.
Don't disappoint your mother. Oh, 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 oh,